Idaho ranks fifth in the nation, 14 suicides. So why are so many members of the state legislature fighting so hard to stop legislation backed by the governor to teach educators how to help kids at risk? Tonight, we talk with the counselors and school officials dealing with the problem firsthand to see why they feel so differently about the governor's plan. State legislator Barbara Ehart says the governor's plan to train teachers to deal with mental health issues in the classroom is a mistake. This is not another burden yet we should put on our teachers. And so what's her plan to address the huge teen suicide problem we have in Idaho? We have better answers and one of the main things we have to do is get back to fundamental teaching. But the people who actually deal with children in the classroom say recent tragedies demand a better response. Last school year the Valley View School District had um, its heart broken multiple times with a few students who we lost. I, I do feel that it seems to be getting worse. It's just not the same anymore. Uh, we have to be adaptive, we have to be flexible, um, we have to evolve. The governor's plan to spend a million dollars on social emotional learning for teachers would help them recognize at-risk students to get them help, usually from a school counselor. Ehart says that's not the teacher's place. We cannot add something else on which we're going to expect our teachers to truly be trained to deal with. Actually, the teachers do. For instance, at Valley View, the district took it upon itself to drop the usual variety of teacher training classes for just one extended course focused on mental health in the classroom. I think we are definitely are seeing success. Um, we've heard feedback from teachers who said this is the best PD I've ever had in my 30 year career. Lot says the training is invaluable. It makes a huge difference in how we communicate with students and how we get them support. Support that Valley View says they refuse to do without, even if the state doesn't get it. Absolutely, absolutely. And we don't want to experience what we experienced last year ever again. Roland Barris, six on your side.